was convicted on three counts of capital murder along with ex NOPD officer Antoinette Frank. 23 year old Antoinette Franca was a rookie with the New Orleans Police Department. During a 1995 robbery, she and Roger Lacaz shot and killed Officer Ronald Williams, his brother Hall, and Chow Vu as they terrorized the family, who owned Kim and the restaurant. Franca is one of only two women serving time on Louisiana's condemned row and is presently housed at the Louisiana Correctional Institution for Women in St. Gabriel. Consequently, let's get to the story. Today's video is about the last hours of an executed corrupt cop on death row. Female cop executed? Frankie had an unstable upbringing, but she was aware of one thing. She had wanted to be a policewoman ever since she was a little girl. Frankie suffered from coming from a broken family as a young adult and later as a teenager. According to Charles Customer, a former police officer himself, Franca became distressed about these issues and needed psychiatric help because her brother was a wanted felon and her father only occasionally showed up in her life, and both of these things caused her to be distressed. Franca lied about her psychological and psychiatric conditions when she applied to work as a cop in Louisiana in order to get hired. When Franca applied to work for the NOPD in 1993, several red flags were raised. She failed two common psychiatric evaluations and was found to have lied about several aspects of her application. Still, on February 7, 1993, she was hired. Do you guys know how she found her future boyfriend and who he was? Frankie served in the New Orleans Police Department for less than a year and was hired despite being discovered to have lied about a number of her responsibilities. She met her future boyfriend during a shooting. Rogers Lacaz, a purported drug dealer, was seriously hurt and needed help from Franca that night, as well as hospitalization. Lacaz and Franca had an intense relationship and fell in love quickly. Franca may have believed that Lacaz had given her the answers she was looking for in life. Franca let the young man, who was 18 at the time, drive her police car around because she was so smitten with him. Nevertheless, she kept their union a secret. On March 4, 1995, after midnight, Frank and Lacaz went to the Vietnamese eatery, Kim An, in New Orleans East, which is owned by the Vu family. As a security guard on the side, Frank had occasionally worked there. Chow Vu went into the kitchen to count money before entering the dining room to pay Ronald Austin Williams II. This happened as the staff was cleaning the closed restaurant. Williams, a Frank co-worker who was utilizing the security guard job that evening to supplement his policeman's salary, was there to help. In 1991, the married father of two joined the New Orleans Police Department. Frank was approaching the restaurant when Chow went to pay Williams. Do you know who else was involved and how she was able to kill them? To get leftover food to eat, Frank and Lacaz had visited the restaurant twice earlier that evening. She couldn't find the front door key when Chow let her out on the previous visit, and when Frank came back a third time, she knew something wasn't right. To conceal the cash in the microwave, Chow sprinted to the kitchen. Frank pushed Chow, Chow's brother Kwok, and a restaurant employee into the kitchen doorway after quickly passing Williams and opening the front door with the key she had earlier stolen from the establishment. When shots rang out, Williams started to follow in an attempt to learn what was happening. Williams was shot in the neck by Lacaz, who crept up behind him, severing his spinal cord and rendering him instantly paralyzed. Williams was mortally wounded as Lacaz continued to shoot him in the head and back. Chow took Kwok and hit him as Frank turned to face the restaurant dining area. As they entered the kitchen, Chow, Kwok, and the worker turned off the light in the large walk-in cooler at the back, where they were hiding. Their other sister and brother, Ha and Kwong Vu, had been sweeping the dining room floors when Frank entered the establishment, but they had no idea where they were. While yelling at Ha and Kwong and demanding the restaurant's money, Frank and Lacaz were unaware of Chow's hiding place. Kwong, 17, was pistol whipped by Frank after he hesitated to reveal where the money was. After taking the cash out of the microwave, Frank shot Ha, age 21, three times as she knelt and begged for her life. She then fired six shots at Kwong. After being detained, Frank was accused of three first-degree murders. That evening, Lacaz was taken into custody and charged. Frank and Lacaz later confessed to the crimes while being questioned further at police headquarters. On April 28, 1995, a grand jury in Orléans Parish indicted Frank and Lacaz. They were both tried in separate proceedings before Judge Frank Marullo. They were both given death sentences after being found guilty of all charges. 
We're done here for today. See you in the following.